What's going on guys? Back at it with another Fallout 76 video. This one, we are definitely going to be choosing a side, whether to side uh, with Crater or siding with Foundation. And if it's not already obvious by what's right in front of us in the top right corner, I decided to side with Crater, which is what I've been leaning on for the entire gameplay, to be honest. Um... I, I kind of wanted to side with the Raiders because my main character actually sided with Foundation. So that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be siding with Crater and the Raiders. So we're going to be going it's over to Meg and talking to her and letting her know that we're ready for this whole vault raid that we got going on. So if you're excited for this video, though, do me a huge, huge favor. Drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get going. Alrighty. Um... Well, let's, uh, go to Crater, then. We 28 caps making me broke over here. But yeah, so let's go ahead and go over to Crater, talk to Meg, let her know that we're ready to get this party started, essentially, and go to, go to the vault and, what is it, Vault 79? Take over the damn place and let them know that it's all, well, at least it's gonna be ours. Because it's not ours yet, technically, but we have everything set up to uh, infiltrate the base, if you will. So it should be pretty fun, I think. Uh, and I've never done this mission, to be honest, with the Raiders. I've done, I've done it with um, Foundation, so it should be pretty interesting, to say the least, because I've never done this before. Alright. But, well, she came out of nowhere. Shut up, lady. All right, let's go ahead and uh, make our way inside here then. The Crater Core, as it's called. I think Meg's going to be pretty happy that we're here. All right, let's go. Run! Meg, I need to talk to you. We got everything we need. So we're just waiting on you to make up your mind, 7-6. You ready to roll? Duh. Warning, once you start the Vault 79 heist with the raiders the uh, at the crater, you won't be able to continue any quest at Foundation uh, with the Foundation Settlers. Yeah, I'm fine. Um, is everyone else ready? Lou's already setting up explosives at the vault entrance. Gale's always ready. And for the amount you promised Johnny, he best jump when I say jump. So yeah, as soon as Lou gives the word, we're ready. She said it as if we're paying him the amount he requested, but we talked him down, so yeah. Uh, how are you feeling about the vault raid? Pretty good, 7-6. With your plans and the best damn crew I could ask for, I think we got a good shot at this. Yeah, all right. Well, then, if I'm ready and you're ready, let's go ahead and get do it. Let's go ahead and get on with this. All right. Go meet up with Lou at the vault entrance. See if he needs any help. The rest of us will head out in a bit. Then we'll do this thing. You dig? Oh, yeah, we'll definitely be digging here soon. Siding with Crater. What do we get from this? Um. Are you gonna show me? Siding with Foundation Quest failed? Yeah, not surprised there. It, do I not get anything for siding with him? I guess not. From Russia with Lev? Alright. Well, let's go ahead and, uh, hold on, uh, show on map. Okay, we haven't discovered that place, actually. So, uh, the closest place is the Fisher site, so I think we're gonna have to literally go to the Fisher site and then just book it to the freaking mysterious cave. And we're probably gonna die, to be honest. <laughs> oh, well, we'll try, we'll see what we can do. Should be pretty interesting to say the least. Because we're definitely going to get freaking chased down by a freaking Scorch Beast here shortly. But I have Speed Demon, so hopefully we could outrun the damn thing. Alright, ready? Oh god, here they go. Run! Oh god. The damn bird's literally above us meet up with Lou oh god oh god it sees us run away I guess it doesn't see us I mean the music's going on but we're not getting attacked so 
I mean, I'm not complaining. I'm on melee build as of now, so it's not like I could do anything to him. Oh, fuck. Shut your ass up. Oh, it looks like I got some score. Let's go! Can I have your money, please? Thank you. Oh, God. I'm getting literally freaking blasted from all kinds of places. All right. Keypad. Okay, we're going to have to wait a second. You get the hell out of my face. Maybe I can push the buttons before they come. Eight, five, zero, three, six, two. Oh, snap! Where is he? Woo! That was close. Well, at least we made it. Vault 79. Hell yeah, boys! This is gonna be sick as fuck, dude. I'm pretty excited. I'm not gonna lie. Come on, get me in. I'm pretty sure I don't really remember exactly what happened. Uh, like the minute details, but I'm pretty sure we got into Vault 79 in a different way with the settlers. Pretty confident, actually. Do something about this beast. Why is he... Why is he locked down? Oh! Oh! What the hell just happened? If Yinz ends up seeing Fissure, give him a mouthful for me. Alright, here. Got it? Good. You killed it. Now, can we focus on untying me? Yeah, I kind I'm of too already did. This kind of crap. What the hell Thanks. were you doing, anyways? She took Yins long enough. Um, you gonna explain to me what happened? Freaking traitors is what happened. That asshole Lev, he's had it in for me since the start. Don't like us ghouls. He got Fisher, Serge, and some others on board to sabotage us. They jumped me while I was setting up demo charges around the vault door. They must have been familiar with our plan. Because they took off with my detonator and left me here to die. <laughs> Joke's on them. The end showed up before the trank dart wore off on our friend over there. That's not nice. Um. Who, wait, who's Lev and why would he do this? He's just some Soviet former mobster, Jagger. He and his crew joined up with us a while back. You probably saw him hanging around a crater core. I think of himself as Meg's number two. But I don't think she thought the same. Don't know why he did what he did. Maybe just hates ghouls. Maybe he hates the rest of Meg's gang. Maybe both. I'll remember to ask him next time he tries to kill me. <laughs> Alright, um... So what do we do now then? Well, if Yinz want to get into that vault, we gotta get that detonator back. To do that, we gotta find Lev. But first things first, you gotta tell Meg. Get her to get a team together to hunt him down. Go on. I'll be fine here. Doubt those Jagoffs coming back. Yeah, I'm... Lev is gonna die. I'm pretty confident about that. Alright, so let's go I'm ahead and get on out of here. I'm gonna go ahead and switch camera views to be honest. It uh it's just a lot easier to get into combat and stuff with this camera view in my opinion. It, and to do everything like looting and stuff like that, to be honest, everything is better in first person versus third person. It's just for video content, it looks better the other way. May I exit please? Thank you. Wait, hold on. So where am I going now? Oh, of course. Back to Crater. Back and forth. That's what it wants me to do. And here I was thinking that it was just going to be an easy shot into the vault. But apparently not. 
That'll be too easy, apparently. <laughs> Either way, it's all good, man, because we managed to get this far into the storyline. This is literally, I believe, the last mission of the game. Well, when it comes to Wastelanders, of course. We still have to do the companion quest lines. So that's something I definitely want to do at some point. That is such a cool freaking shrine, man. Not gonna lie. Over there by West Tech. Alright, what we got going on? Meg, I need to talk to you. Need to talk to you? Very good. I've been hoping to run into you. Something fishy's going on here. You know anything about where Lev is? Yeah, about that, actually. I was going to ask you the same. Uh, well, Lev tried to kill Lou and sabotage our plans. He actually took the freaking detonator. Bastard did what? Now that I think of it, I haven't seen him, Fisher, Surge, or a bunch of others either. Guns and other supplies have gone missing, too. I think we got ourselves some defectors. Same here. Um... Well, let's get a search party together and hunt, hunt these freaking betrayers down. Nah, too risky. We gotta play this cool, 7-6. Lev's a crafty son of a bitch. He's gonna expect a move like that from me. But you know what he ain't gonna expect? You. One lone 7 -sixer who don't play by the same rules. I know you got the skills. That's why I'm trusting you to do the hunting yourself. Um... Oh... Okay. So, how do I find him? I'd bet dollars to donuts that Lev left some poor sap behind to keep an eye on us and report back if we made a move against him. I done some digging. Seems like Creed, Axel, and Barb were each talking to Lev right before he left. I think it's one of them. Problem is, they're all liars in their own ways. Maybe, if you go with the right approach, you can get something out of them. Oh, crap. All right, I'll see what I can do. That Wait, hold on. What can you tell me about Creed? Creed's kind of a liar, but only up to a point. He's a major pushover. If you put enough pressure on him, he'll always buckle and come clean with the truth. Okay. What about Axel? Good kid. Seems to be pretty honest. Unless he's protecting someone he cares about. Then, he's got a reliable tendency to lie for them and be the fall guy. And Barb? I like Barb, but she's all about self-preservation. She's quick to lie to save her own ass, but loves seeing someone else fall from grace. She'll snitch if she knows someone else is guilty. Okay, I'll see what I can do. You've got my permission to deal with a mole as you see fit, but you better be damn sure they're a mole, and only after you get them to squeal about Lev. Oh, and 7-6, if nothing turns up, check with the bartender, Molly. She sees and hears things. She's reliable and trustworthy, but her talk may not come cheap, so I wouldn't go to her unless you need to. Good luck. All right. Are they all inside here? Well, one of them for sure is down Believe here. Believe it or not, you're not the only thing on my plate right now. Shut so I expect you to up, do your part Meg. if you want this vault job to so Who's this, Barb? All right, she's the self-preservation yeah? lady. What is it? I overheard you talking to Meg, so I'll answer your questions. Whatever it takes to get you to stop hassling me. I got nothing to hide. You better not. Um. We're thinking of hiding out near the train. Um. What can you tell me about yourself? Um. I like nice long walks, long nature trails, and I hate it when assholes like you ask too many questions. Maybe I should kick your ass. What do you know about Axel? <laughs> a lot. Me and Axel are shacking up. He's like a puppy dog who thinks he can protect everybody, but he's not as tough as he thinks he is. Alright, um... Uh, he tries to protect everyone? What exactly do you mean by that? Okay, here's an example off the top of my head. Uh, Serge caught Axel's best friend Creed cheating at cards. Things got real ugly, but Axel stepped in and claimed that he was the one who dealt Creed an extra ace. Creed and I knew that was BS, but we let him do it. 
Anyway, Surge kicked the shit out of Axel. So he succeeded in taking the fall for Creed, but he couldn't protect himself. Hmm. So, word is that he might be working uh, for Lev. What do you think? <laughs> Axel? Ah, oh, hell no. Lev knows Axel's all barked and no bite. There is no way he'd trust Axel with anything important. Huh. Alright, that's enough about Axel then. Good, because I don't want to talk about him with you anymore. Um, well, what can you tell me about Creed? You want to know about my brother? Creed's a coward. Always has been. Wait, he's he's your brother? Why do you say he's a coward? Because it's true. Just last week, he stole some chems from Irie's store. Instead of shutting up or pinning it on somebody else, he caved after Irie asked him. Three times was all it took. Did you do it? No. Did you do it? No. Did you do it? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I mean, that's not exactly how it went down, but it may as well have been. An idiot. And now he's paying her back and then some. Um. It sounds like you really don't like your brother. He may have helped me survive the wasteland after our parents died. But he's always been a loser. Always running, never standing up for himself, getting us into trouble more often than getting us out of it. Here we are, raiders of the wasteland, and he refuses to go on any raids because he's too damn scared. Like I said, loser. Um. So do you think uh, he's working for Lev? Oh, absolutely. Just because he's my brother doesn't mean I'm going to cover for his ass when he does stupid shit. Creed is just the kind of coward that Lev can bully into doing anything for him. I even saw Creed talking to Lev just before they escaped. It's got to be him you're looking for. Hmm. Let me see here. Uh. So it could be, it could be him? I don't know. Maybe he, she's just protecting. Fine. I hate talking about him. Um. Crap. This is hard. Are you it's working for Lev? Screw you. Based on what? Okay. Yeah, Not only I'm gonna have to wait for guilty. this. If you're looking for the traitor, why don't you go ask Creed? We need to be long dead in one of those See, I think it's too. She doesn't like March. Creed, okay. so. Bet they feel pretty stupid now. I don't. Pretty dead too. I don't think that could. Uh, I don't know, man. This is actually really hard to be honest. Um. I think we're going to. Go talk to the other ones. Nice weapon. Love me those big whackers. Shut One the hell up, dude. Damn. Alright. Where's the exit? Wait, hold on. Okay, so she's over here, so it's gotta be on this side. This is actually pretty hard, man. Uh... So far, the person that we have to blame, it's, uh, it's Creed, but I'm not sure if it could be Creed because it just sounds like there's some sort of brotherly or sisterly, whatever, animosity going on. All right, there's somebody over here, so. You. Oh, it's Creed. Hey. What do you want? Uh, so, Creed, what was Creed? Creed was the guy that, all right, Lev's gone, you're gonna tell me what you know or else you're gonna answer to Meg. Jeez, no need to be so hostile, I'll talk. Okay, so, 
I'm new around here. I don't know much about you. What can you tell me about yourself? Well, me and my sister Barb joined up with uh, Lev's crew before he merged groups with Meg's gang. Uh, I mostly do work here at the crater because I don't really like going on the raids. Not really sure what else to say. What about Barb? Tell me about her. Barb's my little sister. Been taking care of her since our parents died. Or at least trying to. Careful what you say around her. She gets a kick out of throwing other people under the bus. Especially when they screw up and lie about it. Yeah, speak about it. She's trying to throw you under the bu uh, bus. Um, so she's a snitch? What's the deal with that? Damned if I know. She's a troublemaker and always lies to cover it up. But maybe she thinks if she rats on others, people won't think she's lying herself. She snitched on Johnny when he messed with Ren's radio equipment. I guess Ren thought she was trustworthy. Later, she killed Ren's dog because it wouldn't shut up. And she got away with it. Ren totally bought Barb's alibi. Wow. Do you think she would work for Lev? No way. That creepy old Russian used to make passes at her. It was ugly. Barb always used to complain about it. Until I told Meg about it. Meg finally threatened his manhood with a shotgun and told him to step <laughs> off. He backed down. Um... You sure Barb would work with Lev then? Uh, yeah. I already spoke to Barb and asked her about it. I know my sister. She wouldn't be in league with that guy. Are you hiding something, Creed? Do I need to beat the shit out of you so I can get the truth out of you? Okay, okay. The truth is, I don't know if Barb is or isn't working for Lev. I never actually talked to her about it. I seriously have no idea who's working with Lev. All I know is it isn't me. I swear it's the truth. So I, I believe it's not him now. Um, I think I know enough about Barb. <laughs> Probably too much. Am I right? I don't know. Barb is kind of my suspect right now, to be honest. Um, what do you know about Axel? Axel? He's my best buddy. Is something wrong? Did he cover for Barb again and get himself into trouble? She doesn't deserve him. Okay, hold on. Does this happen often? Huh. <laughs> More than you'd think. He'd rather get in trouble himself than see someone else suffer. Like, just a couple weeks back, I was playing cards, and I may have used some sleight of hand to give myself an edge. Search figured it out, but Axel stepped in and told her he slipped me an extra ace card while he was dealing. Saved my ass, but got his own beat. Then Barb ratted on him, told Serge he was just lying to protect me, and Serge just beat his ass again. <laughs> uh, do you think uh, he would be working with Lev? I don't like to think that my best friend's a traitor. But yes, it's possible he's Lev's mole. I've seen Axel sneak into Ren's comm station to radio with Lev when she's not around. At least, I imagine that's what he's doing. Are you sure about that? Yeah. It bothers me to think that he's been working with Lev this whole time. Oh, I wouldn't put it past him if he was doing it to protect Barb somehow. Um, maybe. I'm going to find out sooner or later, dude. If you want to live, you better tell me the truth. And when I say tell me the truth, I mean now. Shit. Fine. I lied about Axel. I don't know if he's working with Lev or not. I just said it to get you off my back. But, but, it ain't me, either. I swear to you, I could never work with Lev. If I knew where he went, I'd be the first to tell you. So you could put a bullet in his forehead. I... Sure I'm starting to suspect this dude. Are you working for Lev? You're kidding, right? Lev hates my guts. Ever since I told Meg that he was harassing my sister, there's no way we would work together. Just the other day, he told me that his only regret would be not killing me in my sleep. Didn't make much sense at the time, but now I realize it's because he was about to skip town. Yeah, I don't believe it. You've lied to me twice already. I think you're the one that's working for him. No, really. Lev would sooner shoot me dead than work with me. It's Axel. 
Axel's the one who's working with Lev. And you're just gonna throw your fucking best friend under under the bus? If I was you, I'm definitely gonna find out sooner or later, dude. So if I were you, man, I'll tell me the truth. Now. Shit. Fine. I lied about Axel. I don't know if he's working with Lev or not. I just said it to get you off my back. Yeah, but, we've but already went through this. It ain't me. If I knew where he went, I'd be the... Oh, uh, we've already went through that. Um... Sure. So this guy's a... Oh, dude, him and his sister are freaking shady as hell. Um, let's go this way. Alright, where's... Oh, hello. I hope Molly? this little stint pays off. Not that I miss a car. Hey! Oh, wait. Who we got here? What's good with you? She's... She's pretty... Hold on. I'm not gonna talk to you yet, though. You wanna survive? I wanna talk to this other person. Before I talk to the bartender. And if I can't... Find out who it is on my own, I'll talk to the bartender. So, you're Axel. You need help with something? So, you're pretty shady yourself. So... Um, Meg asked me to find out about Lev's disappearance. What do you know about that? Uh, I might. What do you need to know? Well, first of all, tell me about yourself. You want to know about me? I don't know what to tell you. I work a lot, so no time for hobbies, really. I go on raids, do odd jobs around here. You know, whatever Meg needs me to do. What do you know about Creed specifically? Creed is Barb's older brother. He's a good guy, but he cracks under pressure. I wouldn't trust him with a secret. Know what I'm saying? Yeah, I caught that already. Why shouldn't I trust him? Uh, he recently borrowed some tools from Fisher. Now, Fisher's not a very confrontational kind of guy. But he kept grilling Creed about it. And Creed eventually told him everything. Uh, it turns out Creed was just trying to rebuild a suit of power armor he found. And when Fisher found out, he took it to rebuild it himself. Probably the right call. Creed would have wrecked it. Alright. Do you think he might be working for Lev? Nah. I don't think so. Lev wouldn't trust Creed not to reveal where he went. Besides, That's Lev a good hates point. Creed. Something to do with Creed trying to protect Barb from him. Things aren't good between them. Yeah. Yeah, Creed doesn't make sense. Anything else? Uh, what can you tell me about Barb? You mean no Creed's lovey sister? Stuff. Uh, she and I, uh... uh ah, she's great. <laughs> uh, people say she's a snitch. But then they're just mad she ratted them out for doing something they shouldn't have done. A snitch? How so? This one time, Meg thought Barb stole some snack cakes from her personal supply. But me and Barb saw Ra Ra do it. Barb doesn't like kids, so she told Meg what actually happened instead of letting me cover for Ra Ra. But luckily, Meg saw it for what it was. Just a hungry kid who wanted something to eat. And she gave Ra Ra the rest of her snack cakes. You know, Meg is a sweetheart, man. She may be a raider, but she's, she's got a big heart. Uh, You hesitated a little there. I know you and Barb are uh, a thing. We'll just leave it at that. Why are you trying to hide that? Oh, uh, no reason. I just didn't know if she wanted everyone knowing. It's not a big deal. Any, uh, any chance that she could be working for Lev? What? No, that's crazy. I'm the one working for Lev, not Barb. Yeah, uh, now he's fucking trying to protect her. If you're working for, uh, for Lev, uh... Yeah, I don't believe you'd risk exile or death for someone uh, you're having a little fling with. It definitely has to be someone else. Whoa, 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 whoa. No need to go asking anyone else any questions. Really, it was me. So, Hold on. you gonna turn me in or what? Are you working for Lev? Damn it. You're right. I am. I'm sorry. I uh, should have come clean earlier. Uh, I'll tell you anything you want to know. If you're working for Lev, tell me where he is. I uh, I don't know. He, he, he it's not. Say. It's not him. It's not him. 
Lev would tell you where he was so you could report back to him. You're not the one. No, it's really me, and I'm sorry for it. You gotta believe me. It's Barbara. It's Barb. Let's go talk to Molly. I want to find out what Molly knows, but I'm pretty sure it's Barb. Hey, look who we got here. What's good with you? And that's why she's inside the crater. Um... Uh, where does you might have some information, uh, I'm looking for? I might. I got lots of information. I also got lots of expenses. They cost me around... 300 caps a week. Know what I'm saying? It just so happens I might have 300 caps here for you. Well then, I guess my problems are solved. Now I can help with yours. What do you need to know? Well, someone Meg suspects been... someone is working with Lev and might have some trouble figuring out who. Do you have any idea who that might be? Is that what you're here for? Shit! I could have asked for a lot more then. That's probably why Meg sent you. She just laughed at the if price I gave us, her. Well, you better watch your back. I already gave you my word, so lesson learned. Anyway, you want Barb. Lev left her behind to act as his mole and report back to him. Yeah, I knew it. Yeah. They were talking about it outside my bar. Thought I couldn't hear him, but I got wicked good hearing. Couldn't make out where he said he was going, but Barb will know for sure. You tell Barb I overheard, and she'll have no choice but to confess. Uh... Thanks. Anytime, kid. I like Molly. She's super cute, man. Um... How the hell do I get in there? Oh, right here. Let's go. Oh, Barb. I, I suspected Barb from the very beginning. And then, of course, she snitched on her brother to protect herself. And her brother was still trying to protect her. And then, of course, her love interest was trying to protect her as well. It's like everyone's trying to protect her. And yet, she's trying to freaking point fingers. It's definitely Barb. Fisher comes across cool, but... Where is she? I don't trust anyone I can't get a bead on. Well, hello there, Barb. Yeah? What is it? Um, I know you're the mole. Molly said you hurt. Uh... Yep. Molly doesn't know shit. How can she hear anything with the racket they make at her stupid bar? The evidence all points to you. If you confess, I'll make sure Meg doesn't kill you. Let's imagine for a moment that I am working with Lev, which, of course, I'm not. Say I were to confess, even if Meg wouldn't kill me, she'd exile me. And wouldn't that be just as bad? Lev would find me and kill me. You know, if I was the one. Um... Um, if you tell me where to find Lev and I kill him, then your problem is solved, wouldn't it be? Sucks. Meg wouldn't even have to know. No, actually. Enough bullshit. Either you talk or I go to Meg and, and let her torture it out of you. Hey, okay. Damn it, you got me to buckle like Creed. I'll tell you what I know. Lev's been building a hideout inside one of his cooling towers at Poseidon Power Plant. He's gotta be there. He said he'd pay me if I kept an eye out for him. In case someone went looking for him. That's all I know. Uh... Don't tell Meg. I swear I'll keep quiet. Damn. Um... Not all about the Brotherhood. I think if anyone could finish off the scorched, it'd be them. Yeah. Now we're back. I don't like that she left me on this goose goose chase. We'll see. I'll suggest she goes easy on you. Oh, damn it. Meg's gonna be pissed. Yep, that's your fucking fault. I hate it when things get messy. It'll be a while before I get that image out of my head. She should have just came out with the truth from the beginning. Come on, 7-6. You got this. Now get out there and get to work. 
Wait, wait, wait. First you of all, you want something? Uh, you take it. It's the only way to live. I can't tell her, unfortunately. So let's go to Lev's. Well, let's fast travel from here. What am I doing? So Poseidon energy. Poseidon. Hold on. Where where the hell is this? Oh, it's way out here. Lev's hideout. All right, we'll fast travel here then. Forty-five caps. Damn it. Yeah, I don't even care, dude. Barb, she's a POS in my eyes. First of all, she betrayed her people. And then after she betrayed her people, I tried to get the truth from her. and She basically fucking lied to my face. And not only that, but she tried to freaking sell her brother. Throw, her, throw him under the bus. And her brother said that she's known for throwing people under the bus. And not only that, but we know that she's a self-preservation type of person. Um, and then her love interest was protecting her. Yeah, it, it was, it's pretty, it was clear as day. This is a Hold on, let me turn Repeat. this off. This is a level two nuclear uh, alert. The Sinon Energy Plant WV-06 has suffered a critical failure. All right, yep. teams are en route. Please remain indoors Quiet. and further instructions. Together. <laughs> no. I'll take that dog food, though. Is it in here? Am I even going to the right place? I don't even know if I'm at the right place, to be honest. I guess we're going to be finding out shortly, right? It says defeat Lev's gang. This should be pretty easy to be honest. Hello. <coughs> Can I have that 45 please? Thank you. Aw, cute dog. <coughs> Screw you, buddy. <coughs> you can die, you can die. Anybody else wanna die? Actually, you know what? I'll take that handmade. I'm probably gonna be heavy, but. Where did that dog come from? You! Guy! Alright, where's. Where's everyone else? Oh god, this guy's gang is huge! Here. Let's go ahead and... There we go. Hey, what's up, bro? <laughs> so much for being in power armor. That didn't save you at all. Alright, where's everybody else? What's up? Where is everybody? Like, I can barely even see everybody. I'll take all the handmaids I can find. Goodbye. No, die. Oh my god. Alright. That was fucking scary. Alright, no problem. No problem at all. Hold on, you come back here. Where'd you go? All right, we're doing pretty decent here actually Considering there's like 900 million somebody has a plasma rifle or maybe a plasma pistol. I don't know. It's a plasma something All right, where's this Can you sit down please I don't appreciate this mayhem Where is everyone? Oh, hello. Oh, that was Surge. Nice. Confront Lev. Oh, he must be that asshole that's inside the middle central building. Yep. Definitely. Oh, no. I'm over encumbered again. 
Honestly, I don't mind it because there is a, uh, oh man, I didn't make it. An armor workbench in the middle. Wait, hold on, let me kill this dude. So he's not fucking bugging me. And while I'm here, I might as well do this. Alright, where's this asshole with the minigun? Sorry, buddy. Alright, good. We're healing again, which means... Everyone is dead. Alright, I can't jump up there. Alright, we can climb up here, though. There we go. Requires terminal? Is this a legendary? Do I even have these perk cards? No, what am I doing? What am I doing? Um. Alright, it's this way, that's why. Uh, perks. So I have. Two. Oh no, it's intelligence, isn't it? So I got one hacker. I only have one hacker, so now I'm not going to be able to get in there. Right? Because this is requires two. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to. So let's go ahead and confront homeboy right here. Hey, what's up, Lev? So the Volk cockroach does make sturdy work now, huh? You're going to answer my questions, and then maybe I won't kill you. Oh? You think you intimidate me with big muscles and idle threats? Go on. Let me see if you can form coherent question. Why'd you sabotage us? Opportunity. I was to be paid handsomely to stop you and hand over detonator. Opportunity to be rid of Meg and other weak, pathetic freaks, animals she takes in. Who was going to be paying you? Man from Foundation named Rocco. Said so they'd pay in guns, ammo, information. How best to strike Foundation and take for ourselves? Something Meg would never do. Hey, maybe you kill Rocco now. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> uh, first of all, what the hell's your problem with Meg? Meg is too soft. She take in useless kids, freaks, animals, anyone she feel bad for. She tells us, recruitment is better. Kill only for food and supplies. I say we kill for more. Out there, it is kill or be killed. Um, I mean, he's got a point there, but... No, I don't, I don't agree. Do you really think anyone who isn't like you is a freak or an animal? Ah. Only room for strongest, best men in this world. Others have their uses, but they are not equal. Uh, you're disgusting, but I'm definitely not done with you yet. Eesh, hurry up and get... Shut up. There's something else I want to know, alright. So why'd you target Lou? Lou? Sad old walking corpse. Was easy target. Ogo should be dead. Got tired of waiting for him to kill himself. Took matters into own hands. He had detonator. Which was key to your plans. Kill Lou, get paid to ruin plans. Sounds good to me. Freaking psychopath. Uh, you should know he's still alive. You pretty much failed your mission. Eh, for now. Old fool will kill self sooner or later. Um, it's bad enough that he wants to die without you trying to kill him, asshole. Who do you think put idea of going feral into Lou's head? <laughs> Much easier to get away with if he kills himself. This guy's an idiot. Let's... Alright, um... Alright, 
Why did you break into 79, uh, Vault 79 yourself? Vault is waste of time. I hear talk of gold. Gold is useless. Real value comes from guns, food, ammo, information. I get better offer to ruin your plan. You're an idiot. Uh, you would have have uh, found those in the vault too, you idiot. You take me for fool. But I am not the one breaking into top secret government installation full of armed guards and deadly machines. How about you? Eddie? All right, let's see what else. Uh, give me one reason why I shouldn't kill you. I will not. I would do the same to you in this situation. Wait, no, I would not even talk. Just kill. All right, good point. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, dude. All right, let's see what's in here. Eh, nothing important. Ooh, stash box. And let's play this. Meg. I know you will find this tape. Also, I know we will be long time gone when you do find it. I know this because you are weak, ineffective leader. You could not leave gang out of wet paper bag. <laughs> too weak, too stupid, too cowardly. When I hear you invite that cock and want to go off on some ridiculous vault heist to find gold? I call that last straw. Serge and Fisher know how stupid plan is and how terrible leader you are, so they come with. Leave you behind with freaks and losers. Not this, Meg. We will gain more men. We will come back powerful. <coughs> Excuse me. We wipe you and your freaks off, man. Sleep tight, by it. Uh, let me eat really fast. And then we're gonna fast travel over back to foundation. I mean, to uh, the crater. Got to report back to Meg and uh, see what she's got to say. And we should have everything in order now. The next portion of this is now basically just breaking into the vault. That's actually pretty exciting. If it ever decides to load, of course. <laughs> Nice. Let's go. Axel, you are covering for the freaking traitor, you asshole. I should off you too, man. I mean, I guess I don't blame him too much because he was covering for his love interest. But, I don't know. Still. Regardless. I don't like being lied to. And I'm a raider. Come on, what's the deal, 7-6? You get everything sorted out? Uh, as a matter of fact, I did. I found Lev, killed him, and got the detonator back. I assume you had to kill Fisher and Surge, too. Shit. They were both great assets to have on our side. It's a damn shame Lev sunk his teeth in them and turned them against us. Yeah. Um... So why'd you keep Lev around anyways, if you knew he was such an intolerant asshole? I knew he and I didn't always agree. But I gave him food, shelter, all the supplies he needed, and he always got the job done. I don't know. I should have trusted my instincts more. I should have known there was more to how he treated people around here. You can bet I'll do better about that now. We take in all kinds, so there ain't no room for insubordinate, intolerant pieces of shit like that around here. Agreed. Um, you ever see a scorch or super mutant take an elevator? So I had to kill most of the traitors. How is that going to affect Crater? Man, I don't know. You did what you had to do. Fisher, 
He held this place together with that brilliant mind of his. Surge was a better shot than most. She never respected me as a leader. Even though we lost our best lookout, I think we'll be okay. And good riddance to the other traitors. Anyone who doesn't want to follow me, doesn't respect what I do for them, can take a hike. Those that ain't dead by your hands are in for a rude awakening out there by themselves. Yeah, you got a point. So, we should be good to go now. At least we got who we need for the vault raid still. So how about we all go break ourselves into a vault? Assuming nothing else gets in our way, we'll meet you at the entrance and crack that sucker wide open. Hell yeah. It's gonna yeah. be a good day. I can feel it. <sighs> Hell yeah. That was... Some hustle, seven, six. We got a vault to raid. That was definitely very interesting, to say the least. But unfortunately, we're going to have to call it a mission or a video right here, right now. We're already close to that one hour mark. So in the next video, we're definitely going to be going over to the vault and finding out exactly what's inside. I'll see you so at the if you enjoyed this video, though, do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, catch you guys in the next one. Deuces.